Hello guys, it's Chumas, and we're going to have a Baylid unboxing. This is the uh, Metal Fight Explosion Anniversary set. This is a very, very nice uh, set. So we're going to go ahead and take this out. That looks awesome. So, oh, there is something on the back here. You just see it looks very Metal Fight, uh, which is always good. I do like Metal Fight. Um... And there is the little window here. You can see the artwork as well, which looks great. There are the bays, which you can barely see, but they are in there, and there's the launcher. So we're going to go and open this up, go through everything. Uh, I'll show you everything when it is out of the packaging. So I'll see you then. All right, and now I have everything out of the box. So we're going to go ahead and start off with the launchers. So first up here, we have the left launcher looks like this you got the thing that is a very long launcher well wow. you have this little mark here which is nice and then there is the lr launcher oh that's based on old dragon this is based on perseus so you have the of course the like the right left whatever and this blue this is also based on the perseus launcher very nice attention to detail here i did not think that they would include that but they did so very nice. Uh, obviously you don't get the white prongs because you don't change the prongs in this, but hey, that's fine. Uh, that I, You can't really do anything about that. This is good enough. Now we do have this guy. This is Galaxy Pegasus. So this is really cool, of course. Uh, we would also do have Storm Pegasus right here. A quick comparison. This definitely looks better. Taking it apart, you can see it has five and glaive as well as jolt dash. Pretty hard part to get, actually. It's not the most common thing. Also, with these remakes, you actually push out the teeth. I th I think anyway. Uh, let me. The other one worked, and I just did it as a test. Uh. Well, I guess I'll just show you on that one. This thing is, like, stuck. But, yeah. Basically, this top part comes out. Actually, can I? I should just probably do it. Okay, this thing does not want to come out. Okay, oh, well, I got it. I got it. I got it. We're good. Okay. Finally, jeez. So here's Galaxy on its own. <coughs> Very nostalgic. Is some metal in here, which is always nice. And then here is Pegasus 2. Obviously the face and clear wheel are merged, since they have the teeth, but very, very cool regardless. So yeah. Next up, we have Reunicorno. Looks amazing. Parts are one dash proof and unite dash. We have, of course, this also should come out. I realized the problem. I was pushing out the teeth while holding onto the top. I am a genius. Okay. So yeah, here is the metal uh, inside here. Got some. This is Ray. Very nice. Here is Unicorno. Also very, very nice. And obviously, if you wanted to, you could mix and match with the metal and clear reels. Uh, well, mostly. There's like three of them that can, two that can't. So it's kind of weird, but you know what? It's, it's, it's fine, trust me. All right, anyway, let me put this back together. <coughs> there you go. All right, moving on to Medio El Drago. The frame just came off on its own. There we go. 
looking very nice. Parts, seven vortex and spiral dash. Now this thing's interesting because its modes are a little more interesting than the others. So this is actually kind of hard to take off. Um, let me. go off camera right quick to try and separate it. There we go. So here's Medio on its own. You see the metal and the paint here. So it's pretty nice looking. El Drago 2, the rubber, really nice. So this you can't mix and match with the, anything else, but you can choose which way. So you could orient it like this. You see that this these parts pop out more. Line up with the gold or yeah the gold with the mouths. Or like this. Where the gold or I guess it's more bronze. The bronze pops out more and these are silver. So I'm gonna do this mode because I think it looks cooler. <coughs> so yeah really really nice stuff. Uh, oh, I almost forgot. Comparison to Lightning El Drago. Again, Medio definitely looks a lot better. Moving on to Gravity Perseus. Very nice looking bay. One of my favorite from Metal Flight Explosion. Parts are zero, 00 bump. And a yielding. We don't see yielding very much. Also nice that it's matching the driver color. Here's gravity. And then Perseus. Again, this does not match up with anything else, so you only can use Perseus with gravity. It is LR as well, as it was in Metal Fight. And you choose how to orient it. So, of course, like this, which I don't really like as much. Or like this, which I think looks really cool. You got the red sticking out a little bit. The, these parts are covered. Looks like really, really good overall. So there it is. And probably the worst of the set, honestly, Helicurvix. Uh, th this looks a little bit weird. Uh, I, I guess they did what they could, but it, it still looks a little off to me. Parts, zero, lift, Mobius. This should have been black. Uh, that's that's on them. Like, <laughs> they should have put, put that black. Um, I don't know why they didn't. Aside from that, though... Uh, Hell looks really nice. It's gold paint on the metal. And this looks weird because it's like the plastic, but it's on the metal anyway. Here's Carvix. Looks great. You can mix and match this with uh, Pegasus and Unicorno as well. So that's fun. Putting it back like this. Put it back together. And there you have it, Helkervix. So yeah, uh, this set, honestly, <coughs> this is a really, really cool set. I am a big fan of it overall, aside from the Kervix stuff, but honestly, it's pretty minor. Like, I'm not too upset over it. Uh, overall, just like a really, really nice set. So yeah, that's everything, so yeah. Uh, this is also the last anniversary set. I got uh, all the other ones. This is the fourth and final one that I needed. So we'll see if they do a fifth one. I kind of don't think they will, but maybe they will. And uh, I'll do a video on it if it does happen. So anyways, uh, thanks for watching and bye-bye.